and that that's one thing that kind of it, it, I, I need to let these things go because at the minute I, you just know people are kind of hypocritical yeah have an idea have a thought delve further into it if you believe we might be living in a simulation go further how would we know let's just think about it and thought and philosophy and what is time and everything is there and it's it's physically all there and it's from what we do within this kind of our time frame and our existence and it is to process negativity and maybe that is built in and that's part of it so you know and then just uh, I don't know if that's it's me being negative but it's just then people kind of they don't like it some people they don't like that when someone starts talking about things when I start talking about things you know or it's whatever and that's how I think some people do have like a sixth sense and I believe there is a way of knowing and that's because you are kind of synced up with time and it's it, it's your information it's your energy you're, you're more in tune with it because that's what kind of mysticism is or well, that's what kind of a psychic ability of some kind is and that's how I knew since say the age of 10 that I was always going to be doing something a little bit different it's because it had already happened it was such a big event for me that it's there throughout history frame by frame you know since I was a kid since I was born before I was born I think it's just just vastly complex that's all I like to do but at the end of the day what is what is the point that's fun for me and that's interesting and I can make it creative and interesting and exciting and dark because the world is dark and society is far darker and far sicker than most people could possibly imagine time slips from yesterday well I don't want to die through my own alcohol abuse and I don't want to die without trying to do the things that I want to do in life and then I guess to be I guess it's fact now to be attacked for that for being me is something which it is forgivable of course it is because I know psychology so once you kind of ground it in some very very basic psychology truly grounded with a true understanding you can forgive but for people in kind of especially media academia government what's the point what's the point mentioning government you've got to let them go but for people to attack someone for being themselves is um well where do we go let's sit let's have a little think about that one shall we well that's psychopathy isn't it you attack anyone attack any human being it's, it's psychopathy so I'm being attacked or I feel I'm being attacked I have most certainly been attacked by some people um you know well I'm a graduate for fuck's sake nine years later does it matter no it doesn't not with this so what's going on there what's the thought process there what's the psychology there what's the, the mental health issues there it's all there but it shouldn't be there it doesn't have to be there it's the way people think from a very young age and they get worse and worse and worse and worse as they pro progress through life but they're not progressing that's when you are dying people say that well we're dying every day no we're not no we're not a healthy mind never dies we live we live and we live and we live and then one day our body's going to give out and do we know any more than that who knows but when you are ill when you're projecting self-hate 
and to others. You're not living anymore. You are dying until you overcome that, if you can. And that's what's been going on. That's part of why I'm here, is to talk about these things and be myself.